everyone, so today I wanted to do a makeup tutorial that was a little bit different. No matter how pretty and beautiful your makeup is, if you're not wearing waterproof mascara, it might be completely ruined at some point because everyone breaks down. So basically, I wanted to do a makeup tutorial and the word that came to mind was, I've lost it. That is the title of this look that I'm about to make. And you can use this, like, anytime really. Like, if you find out there's a pop quiz, if you find out you got a ticket on your car, you can use this for several situations. So we are going to get started. I have bronzer here. So let me take... By the way, I don't really know how to use bronzer. I don't even really know what it's used for. We're just going to go with it. Okay. I have a feeling it goes like on your cheekbones like this. Yes. Yes. Okay. Then you blend it. Just like that. You got to Oh. Ugh, wrong color. Okay. In case you didn't know, I just used two different colors. There we go. We're going to even it out. <laughs> Like, that's going to make everything better. Yeah, definitely. Okay. By the way, yes, I still have eyeshadow. I have not taken it off. Same with mascara. Because I filmed a video beforehand and where it was kind of awkward. It really wasn't ready to be uploaded. So my mom gave me this and she said it makes, like, your eyes bright and you're, like, supposed to put it on. I don't know how to get this out. How do I get this out? Okay. Cool. Who needs it anyway? It's overrated. It's not coming out. <laughs> Did I mention that I'm not a makeup guru? Probably should have mentioned that. Am I going to break it? I don't know how to use this. Maybe if I just... Okay. Okay, guess we're not going to use that. Oh look, there's liquid stuff. Okay, what is what does this do? Okay, there's a liquid thing. We're probably supposed to put that on our face. And I know enough that I feel like after this I'm supposed to put some form of dust on it. Okay, definitely not looking human. This is probably the wrong skin tone. You just you just gotta blend it. You gotta blend it. And you know what? In the end, they're gonna be looking like a hot mess anyway. So what does it matter? Okay, great. I look like not myself. Basically, what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to go for a smoky eye. And it's okay if it looks terrible. Because this is after she's been crying for a while. So, I'm going to go with, like, a, a dark brown. I do not have black. So we're just going to go with it. Okay, that's not even close. Okay. Okay, we're getting somewhere. We are getting to places. Okay. Kind of looks like I got a black eye. Do I have any other colors? No? Okay, great. I'm gonna work with this then. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Awesome. Great. So we're gonna work with this for now. This has like a little bit of a smoky eye little bit. Actually, you know what? I am going to put more. Because, you know, why not? For this look, you really just can't have too much eyeshadow. You can have so much of it that you get, like, physically sick. Like, I don't know how you would get physically sick. Um, by putting on too much makeup. Unless you're, like, allergic. In which case, you probably shouldn't do it again. And if it's bad enough, you should go to the hospital. 
Okay, great. Okay, now we're working with it. And this is supposed to be like a, a failed smoky eye. Like, okay. And I don't have fake lashes on me. So what I'm going to do is just put on a bunch of mascara. And as far as I know, this mascara is not waterproof. So. Okay, great. Now, this is the point where we are going to kind of mess things up a bit. Now, you're going to get some, need to get some water before you put on your lips. You don't want red stuff all over your thing. So, basically, now what you're going to do is literally you might need to become this girl. So, you're going to put so much work into your lips and then watch as it goes everywhere. Just your life. You're going to go like this. Yes! That's perfect. This is for like when you want to wipe your eye, but you miss your eye, so you just... Yes! You gotta mess up the lipstick. It can't look good anymore. You're, you've been crying so much that like, you're, you're so sad right now. Okay. And like, you're losing it. Your, your, your life. It feels like things are falling apart. And naturally, your eyeliner needs to show that. And then you're, okay. The eyeliner was going to tie this whole thing together. And it's all dried up. This is how often I use eyeliner. Just so you guys know. Like, I don't use it often enough. Like, literally, this eyeliner, it dried out. That's how often I use it. Bye. Luckily, I have this pencil one right here that I can still use. And you're going to go for, like, a winged effect. And then it's going to go all go bad. It's going to go bad. And then same situation here. And it's going to go bad. <laughs> I didn't need to do that. Oh, oh, this is great. This is... <gasps> you wipe your mouth. You forget you have lipstick on your hand. You wipe your eye. Looks like you have pink eye. Go with it. Let, let's just go with it. So you're going to take your eyeliner back out again. I mean, not eyeliner. Mascara. And since we don't really have... Are you, are you serious right now? Now, you may be thinking, Abby, why are you freaking out? Your eyeliner just uh, did that, too. This is a new thing of mascara! <laughs> That's why I'm angry. Oh, yes. You're gonna do that. You want the the tear streaks. That's kind of hurting my eyes a bit. Like this is uh, like pent up issues that are coming out. Like for some reason, you're crying about like your dog that died seven years ago. Like this is that point. Did my dog die seven years ago? That would be weird if I knew that off the top of my head. Oh, makeup. I should probably be paying attention. Okay, yes. Vogue. <laughs> so not Vogue. I'm going to use some eyeliner to try to get some of that same mascara effect. See if that helps. And I look like a really sad clown. <gasps> oh my gosh, I tried to wipe. Oh my gosh, yes. Oh, and then you gotta get the inside. Oh, oh, there we go. And you, like, try to wipe it away. And it just, it, it goes to crap. I originally had a story for this look. And I am changing it to now. So basically, the story behind this look is that this girl just turned 
21. And she doesn't know how much alcohol she can hold. So this is like her first time getting drunk. And she's like, I just want to turn up tonight. Let's go out and turn up. She doesn't know what she's in for. <laughs> she drinks 17 shots against the advice of her friends. And then she, on top of it, is an emotional drunk. So she's just crying about her dog that died seven years ago. And her friends are like, oh my gosh, we are not inviting her again. And that was me last week. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm only 20, so uh, that was not me. Oh man, where's my eyeliner? I was going to add to this. Okay. Oh, it's right here. So, this is it. Um, let me fix that. That's not supposed to be a dot. Oh, there we go. Yes. Ready for the runway. <laughs> this is going to be fun. This was unplanned. Best comebacks. <laughs> oh, this is going to be great. Okay, I'm, I'm going to come up with some good comebacks. And by come up, I mean I'm going to look it up on the internet. I'd give you a nasty look, but you've already got one. If you're going to be two-faced, at least make one of them pretty. Scientists say the world is made up of protons, neutrons, and electrons. I think they forgot morons. Someday you'll go far. And I hope you'll stay there. Okay, I am digging this look. It's like, hey, I feel like I'm faking right now. I, I honestly, I kind of feel uncomfortable. Um, I feel like a clown. Okay, this is the face of a horror movie. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, ready? Ready? Now, if you sit that into your nightmares tonight, give me a call and ask me to be in your next horror movie. Bye!